This is Young Trader. It is Thursday morning, so it's time to go back to work. Now, the uh, EIA report uh, will be out today on uh, natural gas at 10.30, crude oil at 11 o'clock, and then on Friday we have the rig count. Now, the API there on uh, Tuesday was uh, kind of mixed. Uh, crude had a, uh, a build of 2.3 million, but gasoline had a good draw of 1.1 million. Dislis had a build of 0.5 million, and Cushing had a build of 0.5 million. So we've got to see how that EIA report is going to shake out today. So as usual, we are going to review crude oil here and natural gas. This video is for information purposes only, not a recommendation to buy, sell, any stock commodity ETF. Please like, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Okay, here we have crude oil, your daily and your weekly chart. Now, what we can see here, uh, which is very, very nice here, this is that inverse head and shoulders pattern, okay? Your left shoulder, your head, your right shoulder. Now, uh, so far, what do we have here? Okay, so we had that high of 80, uh, uh, 85, and then we have here 81.16 here going on here. Okay, so. Here's what we got to have. Now, if we can get above all this here, that 81.16, then what we're going to do is we're going to be looking right to the left of your old chart here, okay? So the next line in line is 81.57. We looked at the bottom of that candle. We're looking at 81.99. We looked at the bottom of this candle, 82.40. And then we look right there at 83.30. And then we have 83.91. Uh, and then that's what you're looking for is at 84.46. Just bring that old price channel right across there very, very nicely. Next big level is going to be the top of that candle. Bring that price channel across, 85.64. Then the next level is going to be right there, 86.18. And here's your, we can follow these candles, but realistically, there's your big retest at 87.67 uh, here. Now, this is good. This is a very, very bullish pattern, what we got going here, okay? Because what we have here is the eight day came down, then it rolled right on up here. Now you crossed over your 21 day, and now she's looking to head right towards your, your 50 day, your 100 day, all right in that, that area there, okay? Now, when we look on your weekly chart, you can see here how we held that eight day. The eight day is still, uh, uh, the price is still above that eight day very, very nicely, and we're above all these key levels here, okay? So you have your 21 day at that uh, uh, 7951, uh, you have 7973, 78 here, and then we have that 100 day here, uh, uh, 7965. Uh, as long as we hold all that, so even if it sells down, and but it holds this key support level here, this is still very, very bullish. Now you look at your, your MACD, your green is trying to curl right out up here. If you can get across that red again, this is what happens, okay? Boom, you get right to the upside here. So this is looking very, very good. Plus we had that nice bottoming candle with that higher high and higher high. That's always very, very bullish here. Now, what we're gonna have here on the downside is what we always wanna watch is, we wanna watch the top of this candle. That's at 80.62, okay? So that's what we wanna watch. And then we wanna watch here today's low. You're looking at uh, 80.30. And then we can just start coming into these uh, simple moving average. You have uh, 79.80 right there, and then we have 79.68, and then we have this uh, 79.58, and then right here is going to be key is this 79.08. Now I can see all that really lines up very, very nicely with everything that we have on your weekly chart. There's no really no big spread, a little bit here and there. That's about it. But as long as we hold that 8 SMA here. We just crank that bad boy right on up here. That, that's what we're looking for. See, once again, that price gets above that 8 SMA, see how nicely it rolls? That's what we're looking for. But always watch one thing is when that price gets a far away from that 8 SMA, it wants to pull right back into it, okay? So when that price gets below it, well, then we obviously we know what happens here. So right now, we have a good bullish move here. And we got this everything that's going to be coming in here. Okay, so what we have is we have that summer driving coming in. We have uh, the month of uh, August, which is right around the corner. Uh, that's very volatile month. You got uh, you got hurricane season, and we're starting to get the tropical storms here pretty early here developing here. So any kind of disruption is going to send crude oil uh, much higher. So you can see here how we had in the past here. We had that nice series of higher lows and higher highs, and once she goes, she goes. And then what you do is we're still in just starting in this pattern. Uh, so we always look for a topping tail like this. See where we have a, uh, a high. We had that high of 87.63. And then we come in here. And then you have that 87.67. See that double top scenario? Okay. When you get that, then that's, then that's when you want to get out of the trade. But right now here, look at how nice we're looking. We're looking very, very bullish. And a nice series of higher highs and higher lows. Okay. So today what we want to watch on the downside 
is watch the top of that candle 8062 and then we want to watch that 50 day looking at uh, 7980 we that 7968 and then right here that 17958 but this is going to be the key one as long as we hold this 7909 level here on the closing basis that's very key. Now, a lot of times you can come all the way down here, touch that. As long as we can close above all of this, then we're in really, really good shape, obviously. You know what I'm saying? But again, if it's lost here, well, you have a big target here at 77.61. That is going to be your 21 simple moving average here. But right now, this is looking very good. And upside, watch that 81.16, okay? That's going to be very key. If we can get above that, watch here. Your next target is going to be 81.57. And then we have your... Uh, uh, 81.99 and then we're going to come right over here to your uh, 82.40 and then we can just work yourself right on up here all the way until we come all the way to this bad boy up here 84.46 look at <clears throat> rsi looking very very good here sitting so at 59 plenty of room to run you have that bullish cross here on your uh, green over your run that's a buy signal uh over your red that's very very looking very good so let's just see how this all shakes out here so uh, to me, I uh, won't be doing anything I like on the short side, but I am uh, long uh, the UCO right now. Any kind of a pullback, as long as it holds this area, I'll be adding to the position. Okay, let's take a look here at natural gas. Okay, here we have natural gas daily weekly chart. Now, really nothing is, has, has changed, okay? Let me just bigger up there nice for you. Uh, we're trading this range right there. 21 day simple moving average, 2.78, that's your bottom. Okay, top right there, 2.939, that's your eight day. Okay, so this is where you're going back and forth. When we came all the way down, we sold off with that series of lower highs, lower lows. <clears throat> we held the eight the first time. Then she blasted all the way down, but you held that 21 day. Then we put a nice big candle, we filled that gap nicely, and then you notice that right now, where's it going? Right into the eight SMA. This is why you trade the charts. You know exactly where it's going. It's your roadmap. Okay, now again, we get above this right here, that 294, then what we're looking for is right there. That's your next level right here, okay? So this is three flat, okay? Then right here, 3.09, 3.13, 3.15. Nothing's changed. Everything's the same. What we want to look for on the downside here, you're sitting at right now at 2.855. We're looking here, realistically, is this 21 day? This is the key, 2.78. You have to hold that. If that is lost here, then what we do is we just come right over here. You're looking at 2.75. We're looking at 2.65. Okay. Then we come over here. You're looking at 2.60, 2.57, and then you're going to come rocket it right down to these levels here. Okay. See this 2.60? That's very, very key. And then we have your 2.51, and then we have your 2.47. So everything you need to do is right here, right now. Okay. 21 on the bottom. Eight day on top. You crack above, we know where we're going. You crack below, we know where we're going. Big target is going to be right there. 260, next big target, 251, next big target, 247. Okay, so you just trade accordingly. So to me, I do the uh, UNG and KOLD. They worked out really, really good. And if all you have to do, if we can't get through that that eight simple moving average, then we short that bad boy down to, down to 21 day. If you lose that 21 day, then that's even a bigger short. You even add to your position and you take your eight down until we we find a bottom. Okay. Upside, you crack above that eight SMA here. It's long time. All the way here. Follow the candles all the way on up. Okay. I'll be back here uh, midday trading and we're going to take a look here at uh, natural gas, a little bit more in depth, uh, crude oil. And then uh, today what we're going to do is we're going to put up some seasonality charts for crude oil and natural gas. And we'll see where we stand with that. Okay, thanks for watching.